how's it going everybody i'll bring you here back with another video on final fantasy 16 and uh we're, we're um picking up where we left off which was talking to that guy and he thought he was clock like El elwin elwin arwin edwin something but now we're gonna go and find out what happened between the deadlands are aptly named i didn't realize they the were Phoenix this Cape. close no wonder their crops are failing hope you guys are excited light is leaching the ether from the soil and when the last drop is drained, their fields will turn to this. No plants, no animals, no life. And no monsters. I suppose that's one small mercy. Mercy? But well, mercy? This. This. What's this? Another relic of the fallen. We won't be able to use any magic here. Another thing to worry about. As if the absence of ether didn't cause enough problems. Take away the lad's life force. And problems are all that's left. Can you use magic? Because there's no life force in the, in the plant and stuff? Here? I can hardly imagine what this place used to look like before the blight took it. I remember. It was beautiful. Damn, Clive. Alright. Let's get some. We're here. There's. There it is. Phoenix Gate. Where it all went wrong. The reminiscent of the past. Damn. Come on, Clive. In them in the fields. It's time to discover the truth. Oh look, I can do uh, this we're going. Phoenix Gates. Oh it's an excited at the same time. Damn it, Torgo, hold on. My man looks badass. Jesus. Almost as if time had stood still. I suppose hmm. no one had any cause to return here. Lost my dad there. It's just as I left it. Murdoch, Lord Commander. Yeah, we lost everybody there. Ash? Forward, bro. Let's have a look around. Here you go. <clears throat> Buried memory. Could I have done this? Could anyone? Damn! Yeah, it was you. Excuse me. The Ross Field flag. Ooh. What is it, Toggle?
Pfeife. What the hell? That's him. Oh. He's the only one who can tell me what happened. I have to know. Bro, where are we going? I don't think that's Joshua. Where is he? I think that's the person that, no, that found him. I can name. Hold on. Okay, the hooded man. A mysterious man that believes to be the dominant fire. I first saw him at Phoenix Gate on the night of the Imperial invasion, and years believed him to be a dominant icon that killed his brother. But Clive, but to Clive's eternal ch chagrin, 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 he has proved otherwise. Out of the flames, if it, if a fire suspected icon that first emerged in the year of the realm of 1860, 864, when Imperial forces attacked the Rosarian stronghold, Phoenix, the Phoenix Gate, clad in fire. Eternal fire, the fiendish creature flung itself against the phoenix, empowering over icon strength and ferocity never seen before its reappearance was to usher in a second shocking revelation that its dominant that its dominant was none other than Clive. The one that yeah, we know about that one. Alright. Damn it! He's like a bloody eel. What is this we, place anyway? We did. Some sort Thanks. of shrine. Oh, yes. Sorry. You've never been here before. This is the Hall of the Gate. The Gate? It's a relic of the Fallen. Only the Phoenix's dominant can open it. Hence the castle's name. This was where Joshua was supposed to... Mm -hmm. Yes. He would have stepped through this door the next morning and listened to the words of our ancestors. Wouldn't it be crazy? He's an open watch. Would you have gone with him? No. No. The Apollo tree is holy ground. None but the dominant may enter. I and the other shields would have stood guard here and prayed for my brother's safe return. Where the hell did he go? It's Perhaps not a he door. Inside. He couldn't have. He'd need the power of the Phoenix. It might not be icon specific. It might just be dominant specific. Like just any dominant. Or him. Because he has a bit to the Phoenix in him, so. Maybe that one. Hmm. Thank you, Joshua. Are you sure about this? Never more. In. All right, let's see what happens. Ooh. Another gate. Let's see if this one opens. Open sesame. Those are always the magic words. Could this place really be a fallen ruin? You could hardly call it a ruin. How do they? It's perfect. Like it was built yesterday. Have you ever seen anything like this? Let's find out. Fallen. An ancient yet highly advanced civilization, those relics can be found across the length and breadth of Valistia. Valistia? 
The material from which these relics are constructed is far sturdier and thin and cannot be worked by modern methods so people of the modern day have elected to build inside and around them instead uh Renzo fortress destroyed in 860 on the what came to be known as night of the flame as a castle invasion and brushes assassins and battle between two echoes of fire that arose ancient ruins lie beneath and are mean after parts of rosary become a province it was of great importance of the people of the duchy being she being the site of the right of our ancestral Bro, we're going down. Oh! What do we do? The usual. Fight him! Hell yeah. Easy peasy, boy. Oh. Are there more? A lot more. A one big boy. A lightsaber. <laughs> I like that one. Beep, 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 How can these things still function? How can any of this? This must be what the fallen ruins were like before they fell. Yeah. Let's find out what the hell they are. It goes. A strange clockwork. Constructs often encounter in fallen ruins. The question of whether or not they are truly alive is open. As they do not appear to require water, do they feed on the flesh of the victims or as beasts do? Similarly, exist solely to protect their habitat from intruders. All echoes are encased in protected bedrooms and thus cannot be destroyed. Though repeated blows will cause the individual plates to dislodge, eventually causing the entire construct to collapse on itself. Oh. Huh. You can't kill it, but what you can do is uh, destroy it. I mean, like, just knock it down to the point where you just can't get it. Oh, hello. Ow. Bigger boy than the other ones. Ah! Looks like you can take a beating. Then let's give it up. Sick of it. Keep your distance, boy. Guru. Get down. Get the boy. He's got boy. Ooh. 
Oh, crap. Damn. Oh, crap. Get him, boy. Get down, son. Keep your distance, boy. Breaker. Does any of this make sense to you? Hell no. None. Let's find the hooded man and leave. Or grab some loot. Oh, we all like a little loot here and there. Should I uh, give is that a potion? Give me a potion. Yeah. High potion. Let's go. Full health again. Got a fight on our hands. Ooh. Okay. Fire, what do you want to call it? Come on, that inches of magic and potion. What? Would Joshua have had to run this gauntlet too? No, at least not that I ever heard about. I imagine the Phoenix would receive a warmer welcome. The hell? Went down again. Or up. Here we go again. Where will we end up this time? Surrounded by contraptions hell bent on murdering us, I expect. Murder. Could the hooded man really have taken this path? Hell no, dude. We won't know until we followed it all the way to the end. Come on. You know he's not the hooded man. Oh, he doesn't. But because he spoke a different language. Another Get in the way, get in the way, get in here, get in here. 
A lot of crap going on. And I mean a lot. Here we got some more. Let's make this quick. That's it. Look at all that money. All right, continue. Anything here or there? Nope. Ocean. I already knew. Kind of fire right here. I can't go back. The hell's going on? Like this. Bro, is there an iron giant? Seems the feeling's mutual. Okay, what's it called? Iron Giant. Yeah, I was right. Oh crap.
down. I knew it was the Iron Giant, though. Had a feeling. Ooh, Fallen Iron. Why, right? Well, I, I knew what it was from previous Final Fantasy. It's done. What do we do now? What are these creatures? And why do they keep attacking us? No answer, just going up. They're probably asking themselves the same thing. We're the ones trespassing here. They're just protecting their home. Hmm. Jill, look. Was in no way is him. Oh damn! Yeah. What is this? Who's that in the back? Is you... that some kind of you? It's worth a closer look, whatever it is. Come on, sprint, bro. Why you got golden shoulders right now? You got no map, so it doesn't matter which way I go. I don't think it matters. Another boss battle? I'm not opposed to it. You can hear something growl. What the? All right then. Bro. Son. Oh, I missed. Get 
right here. Get down. There you go. Come on. Come on. That gauge all the way up. What the hell was that thing? It's a lich. It wasn't like the others. It would seem this place holds even more secrets than we thought. So does it matter which way I go? Okay, so we're gonna go this way first. And then we'll both, and maybe we'll come back and then we'll go the other way. Chunks of wire right. Oh, I'm almost at level 21. Lights. Well, that did something. Did do something. Oh. Open sesame. So, it isn't a dead end after all. Mm -hmm. Apparently not. Okay. Ooh, what is this? What's, it? What's behind the big door? Door number one. Light? Yeah. It all seems to lead to this room. potion. Yep. And look what's in it. Potted tree. And a potted tree. A tree. A potted tree. How old do you suppose this is? A thousand years? More? I don't know. I've never seen anything like it before. Who is that in the middle, do you think? Some sort of god. I just stop for him only. You, 
You're him. The second dominant of fire. No, bro. He's Ifrit. Who are you? Ifrit. Uh, Ifrit. Uh, what? He's him. I am you. I get a quick oh, this is new Joshua chose me to be his shield. He gave me his blessing and asked me to keep him safe. I should have protected him that day. It was my duty. Smiling? You didn't die. Joshua died. I killed him. And I blamed another for what I did. To spare myself the guilt. I feared the Bai. Accepting it, I would lose what little was left of me. So I ran. From everything. And now? Are you ready to accept the truth? I am. I know it won't be easy, but it's what I must do. So that Joshua's soul can finally rest in peace. Take control, bro. This power belongs to you. He's like, what the hell's going on? And you, you took my break from me? You know who I am? Remember to help me to the truth that awaits me. I will press on. Bro, are you gonna fight him one on one? Come, Ifrit. Ifrit. Show me who you truly are. My man just. Oh. Ooh. 
We were done. No, uh -uh, baby. Here, let me show you what sh you should be doing.
from you. Baby. Show yourself, you freeze. You belong to me, bro. Oh, my God. Do the same.
that was amazing. Fire shard. This pistol is also touching. Can be heard some its soft hum. Oh my god. this power embrace it <laughs> oh, talking to me Acceptance. Clive are you all right nope Jill It's nothing. I'll be fine. No more chasing shadows. The hooded man isn't here. We should go. Because he was him. Just like, hmm. Who is that guy, though? Okay. Anything change? No. Clive, are you sure you're all right? Whatever it is, you can tell me. <laughs> I had a hard enough time telling myself. I awakened as a dominant of fire, right here in this castle, and I've been running from it ever since. Mm hmm. But now I know for certain who I really am. The second icon of fire, who killed my brother and burned this castle to the ground, was me, Ifrit. Clive. Yeah? I took so many lives that night, and destroyed so many more, including yours. And I must atone for the crimes I've committed, but not before I learn the whole truth. How could a second icon of fire even exist? And why was I chosen as its dominant? Who is the hooded man who brought us here? And what does he want? It's wild, son. I need to know. And since I'm still breathing, I might as well make myself useful. We'll find your answers together. I want to learn the truth too. Mm. There'll be time enough for atonement when we're done. I was hoping you'd say that. I don't think I could do this without you. You never were one to hide from the truth, even when we were young. And you haven't changed a bit. You're wrong. I have changed. But I don't want to be that person anymore. The things she did were unforgivable. And yet, they're what brought us back together.
Thank you, Jill. Joshua. If he is here, then... The disturbance I felt at the care must have been... Confounded. The hour is later than I thought. So there's Borg. I oh, Benedicta. Tell me who did this. And Miss Hugo. I'll see you suffer the same fate. The man who delivered, who, who delivered the coffin said, he said Sid paid him. I let you run amok with the rest of your rats, and this is how you repay me? Find out where he is. Crush him, flay him, rip out his heart, him and all his filthy brood. Bro, my man is angry. And send every last one of them to out. No. Yes, yes, my lord. Hugo Kupka. Kupka was awakened as dominated the icon Titan, thrust him into the forefront of the Dalmechian politics, winning him influence over both the Republic's armies and the policy making, as well as personal fortune. Huh. He has little love for his country, taking advantage of his business to benefit himself and his stuff alone. His love for Ben Benedict Harmon, however, is absolute. He would gladly betray his every ally just to be damn. A nation former federation of five smaller states that is located in the southern half of the continent form as Capro Grand Ella almost also home to the military Drake's Fang uh, Castle Dad's Ball home of the Hugo Capca I'm in the Titan born of the earth uh Castle Bill do, 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 do. Is it her head? No. Oh, I thought it was an opening. Oh. Benedict. Yeah. I knew who it was. We killed her. Okay. Now we walk back, or run back. Meaning of life. Ah, Ifrit awoken. That was grand control of Ifrit, allowing access to my abilities such as ignition of ice back. What is unlocking the limit? Let me break gauge. Talk to Ifrit to be able to share with those of the Phoenix and be confirmed via abilities. Let me break. Oh. Semi prime into Ifrit. So, what next? We return to it. Um, let's go to abilities. Abilities here. Ifrit channel. Ooh. Ah. <laughs> uh. Oh, fireballs. Oh, I've seen that one a lot. I don't have enough for that. 
For sure this one and this one. Ignition is really good. I don't think I'm going to use that one though. Maybe reset my points back. I do need to grab this one though. Cool. I promised the mayor I'd talk to him again. Yeah. About Lady Hannah amongst other things. Though she may be loath to leave. I can't help thinking she'd be safer with Sid too. Alright. We should arrange an introduction then. Wait, can I just like fast travel back? Uh okay. Give me all this health for who came by and it somebody attacked the village i freaking bet yeah somebody's here dog toggle what is it nothing good i'll wager come on hold on hold on hold on hold on there's something over here remember this now that we can open it we go inside it too damn it come at Or go wait. Oh, fire. You guys are gonna die. You pay for this. Oh, we've got a live one. What are you doing here? Back to me. Remember our orders? No survivors. Who would order such a thing? Oh, 
Damn, Jill. Everybody, get on that blood, bro. All must burn the bearers and those who sheltered them oh my by God. Empress Annabella's command. You're gonna die, bro. <laughs> These dudes don't even know about the mom. They're all dead, bro. And that sucks so bad. Damn. <sighs> she is. I'm sorry, Lady Anna. You deserved so much better. All of these people did. Better than my mother. Ah, oh, we're too late, Gav. Clive. Damn, son. Fox. Acting on the orders of the Duchess, eh? We knew East Pole was harboring bearers. Thought they were safe enough hidden up here, but someone must have let slip. If they'd have only come to us sooner, none of this would have had to happen. Fuck! My mother always did despise bearers. The way father embraced them, when the other nations spat on them as slaves. The way an accident of birth gave them a power that others lacked. But why kill everyone? They meant no harm. They just wanted to be free. This world judges that a crime punishable by death. Which is why we're going to change it. 
Gav, we want to help. Thought you'd got your own stuff to be getting on with. We do. But it can wait. In that case, we should head back and tell Sid you've had a change of heart. He was always on it yet to join us. All right. And we'd best be quick. Last I heard, he was planning another excursion. What about the villagers? Oi! Can I leave you's lot to take care of things here? Of course. We'll make sure they get a proper burial. Thank you. All of you. When you're ready, then. All right, I don't know when I'm going to stop. <laughs> this is getting really good. Damn, son. Hey, Jill got more sprinting speed. What the hell now, is that? Rats, lead me to your nest. Lord Kukka's message for your... Oh, former Duchess of Rosario and Empress of the Holy Empire of Sandbrick. It was her. It was ever her purpose in life to preserve her phoenix-bearing bloodline. For which reason she betrayed her husband, that she might enter into league with the force she judged of my dear. Now she was over as a, the serene of the imperial province, which she rose with cruelty and contempt for the base born that was known was unknown in Archduke Elwin's day. Errors, dunk. Duh. If only he knew where to send it. Thank <laughs> you, bastard. I gotta go back. And nothing else I can do right now. Okay. Then we have a lot to discuss. Alright, so hold on. Bark. I heard Otto barking at his not earlier. Don't mind me. Just taking a break. We can keep running. Or we can walk through this door. Walk through the door. This place is getting more crowded by the day. I tell myself the bustle's a blessing. Yeah. There'll be time enough for quiet contemplation when I'm dead. So, did you find the answers you were looking for? Who we can tell them? I still don't know what to make of this gift, curse, or whatever it is I've been given. But there is one thing I can say for certain. I am a dominant. Ifrit. And there is nothing I can do to change that. It is a burden I must bear until my dying day. <laughs> Spoken true. Forgiveness and in turn salvation can only begin with acceptance. Mm. It's a path we all must walk. No matter how colorful our histories. Sid, you once told me that you wanted to build a place where people could die on their own terms. I did. I've been thinking about that. Why not a place where people can live on their own terms? For 13 years, killing was all I knew. So obsessed with death that I never stopped to consider the lives of those around me. Lives that I see now were scarcely worth living. Mm -hmm. Be they bearers or beggars, most but march blindly to their end, never realizing that they too deserve a choice. And I dare not turn a blind eye to their suffering any longer. So, atonement then, is it? That was the answer we found. The only one we need. Yeah. I'll be 
expecting you both to pull your weight. And we will. <laughs> well then, with a sprinkle of fire and ice, this plan of mine might just work. <laughs> What trouble are you looking to get yourself All right. into? Alright, hold on, hold on. I do not like the fact that they reuse a lot of the, uh, like the intro song and a lot of this stuff. I don't like that. Now, the best kind. We're going to sneak into the Imperial capital and pay a visit to Mother. Hmm. be fun okay so we had a good amount of fighting before this before all these cuts so i think we'll be all right <laughs> and the last of our farm holds i don't know of the north who are you uh, or flame capital of the holy empress i'm really looking um, it's uh oily iced bay and the home of the mother Okay. Eastern provinces has succumbed to the blight. Without their yield, we would be hard pressed to fill the capital's granaries before winter. If there is a capital by then, the black creeps closer as we speak. And yet you do naught but bore and bluster. What's this? If it is fertile land, Emperor Sylvester, uh, Emperor of Holy Empress, Emperor who won his throne at least partly by virtue of his son Dion, have awakened. Uh, okay, the Holy Empress, Empress, did. All right, but there's little prevent. Deadlands. Barren wastes. Um, buried of aether where no life stirs in magic. All but it. Water. Lack of any. Here's the blight has spread over. How do you display? On its own. Damn, son. And the Empire requires. We need but look south. Uh, if you mean the crystalline dominion's holdings, we are bound by mutual accord. Theirs is a neutral state whose borders we are sworn to respect. Gentlemen, did we swear to see our people starve? Well, I really do think. I'm like a douchebag. What? The gates of Oriflam buckle at the flood of those come seeking refuge from the blight. If there is not grain enough to feed those within our walls, how, pray tell, will we feed those without? But instead of setting your minds to riddles such as these, you lock horns with an enemy from across the sea, sending our soldiers to the slaughter in their thousands. The Empire bleeds. And you sit here prattling like crones in a Just straight toss crap, dude. Jesus. And you fancy yourselves leaders of men. Sandbreck is naught without her citizens. We are but their servants. If their land is being wrested away, it is our duty to claim new lands for them. <laughs> Your radiance! You cannot mean a war of conquest. That is exactly what I mean. It is time we expanded our dominion. This is the will of great Grieger. <laughs> there will be uproar. Then we must find a way to distract the citizenry. But how much will that cost? And what of our legions? Shall we raise the furs? Well, someone will have to contend with the Dalmex. I will not keep you. 
you won't have much to do. This dude. This dude's a scumbag. Where is my son? The Lord Prince is currently garrisoned at the Strait of Arthur. If it please you, I can send word requesting his immediate return to the Holy Capital. That won't be necessary. Tell him instead to see to his wounds. Bahamut's strength will be needed again soon. As you command. I must have misheard. You mean to tell me that the Mother Crystals are the reason the world is dying? Are you mad? I have been called that on occasion, but no, not today. We've all seen it firsthand. Empty wastes where once were green meadows. Land drained so dry of its ether, not even the rats remained. But where was it all going? I spent years searching for an answer, until I saw it standing right in front of me. There, in the self-same crystals, we look to for their so-called blessing. All right, listen. Take this crystal. How does it allow us to conjure magics? Answer, by drawing ambient ether from the air. Where do these crystals come from? That's easy. They're mine from the mother crystals. They're one and the same. Although, admittedly, this air fits more easily in the pocket. But the mother crystals are massive. Some as large as mountains. So you see the problem. Imagine just how much ether can be drawn by something that size. As to where it's all going, mind, well... I can't know everything, can I? We are taught that the Mother Crystals are divine. Their ether a gift from the heavens. For centuries, nations have fought and fallen for want of that gift. If what you say is true, how did no one else see it? Who says they didn't? Maybe the truth was inconvenient. Very true. And they didn't care. Inconvenient to whom, exactly? Gods themselves. So now you want to do something about the crystals? And what? We're not helping bearers and dominance anymore. I didn't say that. I made a promise and I intend to keep it. But if we continue down this path, there's only one fate that awaits the realm. And we can't very well set our people free if they're all lying dead in a blighted ditch. Not if we want to create a place where they can live on their own terms anyway. Sort of defeats the purpose. So, if we have to bring the old world crashing down in order to build us a new one, what say you? Are you with me? I suppose it's about time I repaid your faith. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you could have just said I. But it's nice to have you aboard all the same. <laughs> I'm going to need more than a few potions for this. Yep, I speak to Charon, and I see that there's a lot of side quests that opened up. But we'll speak to her, and then uh, whatever's next on the stuff, we'll, uh, that'll be the next video. Then 
I'm gonna do some side quests on the side. Hello. So what God's forsaken corner of the realm is sit? Or a flam. The holy capital. And what business? <laughs> she don't want to know. She's like, don't tell me nothing, bro. Uh, guy blade, bastard sword. Uh, let's get this. Uh, you not find a better price than that. Oh, hold on to this. I'm You're only blind, you know. It'd better all be here. Uh... You're robbing me blind, you know. I'm not robbing you blind, relax. Lion's heart toy. That. It'd better all be here. Yeah. That. You're robbing me blind, you know. Shut up, lady. You'll not find a better price right, than cool. that. Speaking of Oriflam, I hear the trading routes leading south have seen more than double the usual traffic. If you ask me, some up fowls brewing. Mm. And a tin tie is bile tea. Oh, just go. All right. All right, all right. Going, going. Jeez. Builds Otto. I heard Otto barking at his lap earlier. Clive, was it? No. Hold on. Otto. Of my dog. See so you really got. Since yes. we've been talking about bringing down a mother crystal, since I've... he's convinced it's the right thing to do. <sighs> well, you could. Seems the iron in the royalists gave him wasn't enough to dampen old. His legions are on the march again. This time, another war. All as the great Grieger wills it. Bloodthirsty little miss, that one. Still, might work to our advantage on this occasion. Wars with a fair wind behind them. A handful of like-minded ne'er-do-wells could melt into the back alleys of is making it to the checkpoint. That's mm -hmm. right. Okay. Anyone traveling in or out of Oriflam has to go through Northreach. Lucky for you, I might just know of a way. This. this. Well, no, not. And it's the dame who'll see you safely through. We go away. Ah. This is a true. That's good of you, but. Who is this dame? She's the proud proprietress of Northreach's form. And she's quite a woman. A woman. <laughs> Don't go. I'll be expecting. All right. Oh, who are you? Look at me. Looking at my guy. Alliant report. Uh, Alliant report counter had with mass, which is the first breakers. Quest currently. Oh, nice. Very nice. I suppose that's everything. Now to find Gav. Hey, Gav. What's up, bro? Well, well, well. Someone's in a hurry. Yeah. Just following orders. Funny. I never took you for the type. <laughs> Can't all be as obedient as you, Gav. Eh? <laughs> Fine day for a little mischief, wouldn't you say? Is this all of us? Actually, Gav won't be coming. Just the three of us, then? Drake said it's the keystone of the Empire. Oriflam's in chaos, yes, but that doesn't mean we can march an army through her gates. The fewer our numbers, the better our chances of going unnoticed. Mm. And should that plan fail, well, we have our icons to fall back on. Sid, I... I don't know if I can. If Reed still seems to... come and go as he pleases. Ordinarily, priming an icon comes naturally to a dominance. But then, you are no ordinary dominance. Very true. Well, he's still got the blessing of the Phoenix, doesn't he? Uh, Not to mention what he sucked out of Garuda. Yep. And did I ever tell you about how he was once the greatest shield in Rosaria? You know, I reckon he could probably cause a path out of the capital on his own if need be. <laughs> Let's try not to find out. We're less likely to be spotted if we travel separately. I'll meet you in Northreach in a few days. You two behave now. This dude. Dude, Sid is like the best character.
Okay. We got side quest, side quest, and side quest. Alright, guys. Hope you guys all enjoyed that. And as always, catch you guys on the next one. I'll freak out. Peace.